All right, uh, we're talking with Randall Boyd uh, on, after the uh, win against Mississippi Delta. Uh, Randall, obviously uh, some great playing out there by you and uh, the ICC Indians. The play of the game, though, was that punt block. Take us through the uh, punt block, and then you rambling down inside the five-yard line. Talk about it. Yes, sir. Well, you know, we had a, a tough defense this week. You know, we've been going hard, and they were just letting us through. So I just kept on going hard through there and got through the gap, and I blocked the punt. And actually, my helmet had came out, so I had to hold my helmet up and see the ball. And the defense, they were steady swarming and just steady going hard. But the other team, they, they doing good. But, you know, we just outplayed them this weekend. It was a lovely block there, and I tried to get to the touchdown, but I got as much as I can for the offense. Well, I'll tell you what, you did do a great job uh, of running the ball. You just didn't want to go down. Uh, do you play some running back? Have you ever been able to carry the ball like that? Yes, sir. I played running back in junior high, and I played tight end my high school year. Well, you knew what to do when you had the football. You took it down inside the five, and then we scored right after that. Talking with quarterback Griff Loftus just moments after the win against Mississippi Delta. Uh, first of all, Griff, just talk about the performance out there tonight. Obviously, you had a great career at Morville High School. What was it like there playing your first game in college football? It was definitely a lot different. You know, the speed, it picks up, it's so fast. We were a little sloppy with the ball at times, but we came out with a win. And that's what we needed to do. Well, and I think one of the keys also, you had some good numbers, but one of the best numbers no turnovers. Just your take on that one and how uh, to keep that ball from giving the uh, the opponents any easy uh, any easy drives. Yes, sir. That's, a, that's the number one job out there is to take care of the football. The coach stresses that throughout week and week and week. If we can take care of that football, we can win some games. What about overall the uh, performance as an offense? Uh, this is a team that has so many weapons, and you saw you were able to spread it around the wealth pretty well tonight. Uh, just talk about all those weapons this uh, offense has. I thought our receivers did really good catching the ball and making plays after the catch. And our offensive line, really, we, we challenged them to get the run down, and they did a great job displaying the run this week. And more importantly, everybody contributed. Offense, defense, special teams. You go 3-0 and for the first time since 2006. This is a big win on the road inside division play. Yes, sir. I'm just, I'm just glad to be a part of the team. You know, everybody doing their job. It's, that's how winning's done. And it had to feel extra special that everybody stepped up. We had some big injuries tonight and some key people that were hurt, but uh, everybody seemed to step up, and it was really a team effort. Yes, sir. We had some injuries, but uh, everybody stepped up and took their spots where they needed to be taken. All right, Griff. Well, congratulations. Your first start as a college football quarterback, and you come away with a win. Thank you. God bless. All right, we're here with Coach McManus after the ICC's big 39-9 victory in Moorhead against Mississippi Delta to go 1-0 in the North District play. Coach McManus, can you talk a little bit about the offense and about how the guys played today? Well, first of all, it's a great team win for ICC. Um, anytime you can go 3-0, 1-0 in the North, it's, it's a great team victory. Uh, we did play better tonight. We, you know, we had some, some good yards and some explosive pass plays, and we, and we got the run game going a little bit. Still had too many sacks and negative plays that are just disheartening as a coach, but for the most part, to go on the road and, and be productive, it, it was a good night. And one thing, Coach, could you talk a little bit about the fact that last week uh, we didn't run the ball as well, and, uh, you know, you, I know Coach Williams talked about the postgame show about, you know, making sure we were physical and, and that uh, we were able to make plays up front to get the running game going. What do you think tonight overall uh, with the running game? Well, we're, we're committed to running the ball here. I mean, we, we are going to run the ball, and, you know, we, we try to be physical and fast, and uh, we are committed. And, and tonight I think our tempo wore them down a little bit, and, and we finally got a couple of our young backs in space. So it, it was good. And we, we left some yards out there in the run game too and, and some negative plays and things of that nature. But we are committed to running the football, and we are going to run the football. But it was much better tonight. One thing, Coach, uh, Rashard Pargo had a really good game tonight, two catches. I mean, two touchdown uh, catches. And the one thing I saw, though, and I really like to see the receivers, in, your, in the passing attack we run, the guys have got to block mm -hmm. uh, those receivers out there. And I, lo I love watching those guys block. I thought they did a good job just at, at first glance tonight to see them blocking on the corner. Can you talk about the receivers and, and them blocking there and it being a team effort uh, that has to do it in these type of offenses? Those guys, those guys take pride in being complete receivers. And I always talk to them about being complete, you know, blocking, catching being physical, making plays, and, you know, they, they're starting to come together as a group. And I, I thought we had some really good performances from Carswell to, to, to Jarvis Bentley played really well. Rashad made a couple great plays. Um, you know, uh, 
who, who was the other guy. Sanford made a couple good catches. So those guys did a nice job. But they fight for each other and they compete. And, and we work screen blocking every day because that's a big part of our offense. But uh, like I said, I'm very, very pleased with those guys. Could, couldn't ask for anything more. Well, Coach, it's great to be 3-0. The offense is so much fun to watch. Big game this upcoming Thursday. And uh, hopefully we'll have a big crowd to come watch it. Very entertaining. Congratulations. Best of luck the rest of the season. Thank you.